Pat. Welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to talk about uh, Panama by Van Halen, but we're only going to talk about this really fast, uh, short thing that Eddie does near the beginning of the solo. I'll also show you how he plays it in center swing. So let's just begin. We're going to start by using the index finger on our fretting hand, and we're going to put it on the seventh fret of both the first string and the second string. Now, we're not trying to make them both ring out at the same time, but that's going to be our anchor. So we just want to hold them on both of those strings. Uh, I also recommend using the fingertip to try to avoid any extra. You may hear a little bit of the third string, but you don't want it ringing out. Um, two other things. We want the middle finger to go on the ninth fret of the third string, and it's the only place the middle is going to play. So if I say middle finger, I mean ninth fret, third string. Likewise, the ring finger is only going to go on the 10th fret of the second string. So if I say ring finger, I mean 10th fret, second string. Now, the thing about this phrase is it's a play on six tuplets and triplets. I, I don't have a good spelling for you, so the only thing I can say is two distinct phrases to help us get a sense of the sound. It's Buddy Gaia and Manana. And that's just what we're going to work with, so try to follow along if you can. Um, First off, we're gonna put our metronome to about an 80. And I want you to say, buddy guy, buddy guy, buddy guy, buddy guy, buddy guy. I want you to, and, and keep this in mind, try to, don't hold out the ah, yeah. Try to make it short, so buddy guy, buddy guy. Now we play that by, we pick down on the middle finger, and then we pick down on the index on the second. Uh, I recommend raking or sweeping. Uh, I don't recommend down up, it slows me down. And then the last two, it's, it's gonna be a hammer on with the ring finger uh, on the second string 10th fret, and then pull off to the index finger on the second string. So, buddy Gaia, it's gonna be. And keep in mind, um, at that speed, you don't really need to pull off the ring finger. You may feel that it actually slows you down. So just kind of let the, the hammer on flutter on and off really fast. So, buddy Gaia, buddy Gaia. Now, likewise, manana, it's gonna sound like this. Manana, manana, manana. And that's, again, the index on the seventh on the first and second string. We're gonna upstroke on the first string, hammer on the ring finger, and then pull off to the index on the second. And it sounds like manana, manana, manana. Again, you don't uh, pick the ring finger, and the ring finger on both this and this, uh, they're both on the click. So that's kind of what you're aiming for is the anchor of the phrase. So, buddy Gaia, manana, buddy Gaia, manana, all together sounds like this. Okay, now in both Panama and Center Swing, that happens twice like I just did, and then it ends with a ba-da, ba-da. And the ba-da is going to be the uh, middle finger downstroke, and then you're gonna upstroke on the index finger on the second string. So ba-da, ba-da sounds like ba-da, ba-da. So now the whole phrase, buddy Gaia, manana, buddy Gaia, manana, ba-da, Two, three, four, So that's the chunk that happens in both Panama and center swing. Let's speed it up a little bit and then I'm gonna show you how it differs in center swing in Panama. Let's go up to 110. So but gaya manana, but gaya manana, but da. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. Okay, again, really try to let the ring finger flutter. Don't try to pull off so much. I feel like using that, the muscles and tendons like that actually can slow you down, so. And the reason we do pull offs is to make the note ring out. So at that speed, you don't really have to do that to get the note ringing. Let's go up to 140. So, but a guy, a manana, but a guy, a manana, but da. Two, three, four. Two, three, four. One more time. Okay. So, here's where it differs from Panama to center swing. This is one, two, three, four in center swing. 
is slow, but those are quarter notes. In Panama, it's actually one and two and three and four and. So this is the two different feels we're getting uh, with the same phrase. Now, the pickup for center swing, uh, it's not Buddy Gaia, but it's gonna be 16th notes and a one and a one and a one and a one Now, the and a one again, index on the seventh fret, first and second string. We upstroke on the first string, downstroke on the second string, hammer on the ring finger, pull back off to the index. So, and a one two, three, four. And again, don't let the, the pull off slow you down, just let it flutter. Okay, don't, don't try to yank too much, it will slow you down. Uh, now, keep in mind, all three of these phrases, Anawani, Mayaya, and Mayana, the ring finger is the hammer-on on each of those clicks. So, all together, we have this phrase. One, two, three. Anawani, but a guy, a manana, but a guy, a manana, but da. Anawani, but a guy, a manana, but a guy, a manana, but da. So, let's try that. One, two, three, four. Three, four. Okay, let's try to speed that up. Let's go to 180. One, two, one, two, three, four. Okay. Let's try 200. Uh, the goal is 245 or 250. I'm not even sure I can play at that tempo. You know, I'll get close, see how we feel. This is 200. One, two, three. Okay, let's try 220. I think that's my max. Let's find out. One, two, one, two, three. Okay, now the song is pretty much there, not quite. Let's try it, let's try 2.30, let's see how that goes. One, two, one, two, three. That's my limit. So, that center swing, let's go back down to 140. And this is Panama. Now, the pickup for this is different. So I want you to say, and, and, and four. And, and, and four. Now, how that goes is it's going to be a downstroke on the middle finger, downstroke on the index on the second, seventh fret, hammer on the ring finger, pull back off to the uh, index finger. So, and, and, and four sounds like this. Three, four. Two, three, four, one. So all of that together, two, three, four, one. And, and, and four, but a guy, a manana, but a guy, a manana, but da. One more time. And, and, and four, but a guy, a manana, but a guy, a manana, but da. So here's how that all sounds. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. So let's speed that up a little bit. Let's go to 180. Try it out. One, two, one, two, three, four, one. And four. Two, three, four, one. Not bad. So again, this is one and two and three and four and. So what we gotta do is actually bring it down to half of that. So half of 180 is 90. Now, how do we transition from how we were hearing it up there to how we hear it down there? We're gonna keep clapping the one and two and just to get a sense of it. And we're gonna say and 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 four, but a guy manana, but a guy manana, but up as best you can. And 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 four, but a guy manana, but a guy manana, but up. So now, if you get comfortable with that, try to take out that halfway, but you still want to feel it. And I know that at this, those ands should be sixteenth notes, but we're really just trying to say it so we have a sense of how to play it. So keep the ands, keep it the way it is. Um, and, and, and four, but a guy, manana, but a guy, manana, but da. And, and, and four, but a guy, manana, but a guy, manana, but da. So if you're sick of saying it, now we go to play it. 
So let's try to speed it up a little bit. Let's go to 110 like we did earlier. Uh, and and if I'm opening up any of that, I'm not even gonna say it at this point. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Okay. Remember what I said earlier, like the pull-offs might feel make you feel like you're slowing down because you have to use that energy. But at this speed, just use the fluttering to kind of let the note ring out. It'll happen. Two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Okay, so now the song is pretty slow. So we gotta speed it up. Our goal is 142. I'm gonna to go to 125. One, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. Let's see how it sounds at 142. One, two, one, two, three, four, one. Two, three, four, one. So that's the goal. I hope you enjoyed that. I hope it made sense. I'll see you next time.